Felder and good afternoon and welcome to today's COVID-19 update. We're standing by for Health Minister Chris Hipkins and Director of Public General Director of Health Dr. Carolyn McElnay to bring us today's latest numbers. We will join that press conference live as soon as it begins. Political editor Jessica Much Mackay is standing by at Parliament and Jess joins me now. We're expected to hear more details about the masks and them becoming mandatory on public transport today, aren't we? We are. They've actually just walked into the room now, so they will be giving us the up latest update on that, including questions about whether school children will be required to wear masks on buses, for example. So we'll hear the latest on that, the case numbers, and of course the testing numbers that are really important at the moment too. So we'll cross now over to them for the latest details on all of that. Perhaps they're taking a little bit longer than usual to do their hand sanitising today. We are also expecting an update on a report uh, into contact tracing. Now, this has become increasingly important as a lot of us are using our apps. Let's throw to them now. We'll provide uh, today's cases update. After that, I'm going to talk about masks on public transport. Um, from next Monday, the 31st of August, the... Uh, Masks will become compulsory on public transport. I'll set out the details.